How's it going everyone? This is Gotta Transform Wall. Uh, and this video is going to be a uh, league or a local league trade video kind of thing, just recapping all the cards I got from trades and just by being there, uh, which in case you were wondering is all of this. So uh, I'm going to get right into that in a second. Uh, but also, I got three packs from the place that was holding the league, and if you're curious about that, the three packs are a Flash Fire and two Phantom Forces packs, uh, which I will open at the end. Uh, but just so, just to get going, uh, I went to a local league uh, where, uh, just to start things off here, uh, I got a little package of Hollow Foil energies. Uh, not really sure how. Ugh. Not really sure how well uh, you can pick up the Hollow pattern, but it's a pretty nice. Uh, like scratchy hollow effect. I don't know how else. To, I don't know how else to describe it. Uh, but it has they all have the play Pokemon symbol at the bottom, and we got one of each of the energies except Fairy, because uh, I don't exactly. I mean, I, I know these are all dated 2010, uh, but I don't know exactly how old these uh, packs were. Uh, I'm guessing probably since 2010 at least. Uh, yeah, there's no Fairy energy, so oh well. Uh, but I got a ton of trades there today, uh, and I'm just really excited with all this because all of these are new cards, uh, although pretty much nothing is in mint condition. Uh, if, let me just see if I can pull out a random card here, uh, like this one. Oh, this one's actually not too bad. Uh, so bad choice there. Uh, but yeah, we'll, we'll, get to, we'll get to a card uh, as we go along. Uh, so the first card we got here is an Unknown J, which is an original promo card for Pokemon. And I don't know if you guys can tell, but you probably can. Uh, there's a little crease uh, indentation in the card art. Uh, that was fine with me, don't really care. Again, these, th these kind of things just fit in with my collection, uh, which are, like, a lot of the older cards are in similar condition anyway. <laughs> uh, we have a, an Electrode non hollow from Jungle. Oops, skipped one. Uh, we have a Kangaskhan non-hollow and a Vile Plume non-hollow. Then we have a Pinsir uh, non-hollow rare from Base Set Two, as well as a Snorlax. And then I was also lucky to find a Professor Oak from Base Set Two, which is the only trainer card I was still missing. So I was really happy with that one. Uh, then we got the Hollow version of Rocket Sneak Attack, and this is a I was really happy to see this because Hollow Trainer uh, from one of the original sets, sure. Uh, so that's the number uh, 16 version. There's two, I believe, because uh, yeah, they had the other one, but I have the non-Hollow version already. Uh, still, nice Trainer card there. Then we had a Dark Alakazam non-Hollow and a Rainbow Energy, and right away uh, with this card, uh, just to put the other ones down for a second, this is the kind of thing. Uh, a lot of these cards are in this kind of condition. Uh, I may or may not try to replace uh, these cards later, especially if I somehow get a hold of a better looking one. Uh, but yeah, it's far from the greatest condition, but uh, the, per the, the, the kid I was training with uh, really wanted so like a lot of my like EXs and full arts from like tins and collection boxes and uh, legendary treasures. So I was just like, I was kind of like not so choosy. Uh, cause it was a kid. I wanted to be nice. Uh, yeah, this will go into my collection for the moment. Uh, but I might look into getting some, that, getting that replaced later. Uh, especially some of the other ones too. Uh, we got a Brock's Rhyhorn, which is a rare from Jim Heroes. Lieutenant Surge's Electabuzz. Brock, the non hollow version, and Lieutenant Surge. Uh, Cerulean City Jim. Erica's Maids, Misty's Wrath, really scary looking Misty. <laughs> uh, that one's the first edition. I didn't. I don't even know if I noticed that when I first picked it out. Uh, but we have a Tickling Machine, Vermilion City Gym. That's a that's a bit of a wall of text there. Uh, got a Brock's Doug Trio from Jim Challenge, Brock's Protection. Lieutenant Surge's Secret Plan, and both of those are actually rare trainers, and there were some uh, from Gym Heroes that were rares too, uh, but here's another one, like the uh, Rainbow Energy from the Rocket Set, a Goldberry, uh, which is a trainer from Neo Genesis, which as you can see is just kind of like in pretty bad condition, 
Although from what I actually, I'm just noticing that I can probably scratch off a lot of this stuff uh, to make it look a little better, <laughs> but still doesn't look too good. Probably look to replace that. Uh, one of the oddly better looking uh, condition cards here is a Porygon 2 Hollow from Neo Revelations. Definitely one of the more awesome cards from this group, uh, just because it's uh, like an older Hollow from a pretty expensive set. So very nice to get that one. Uh, then we have a Light Wigglytuff and Scyther from Neo Destiny. It's a very cartoony uh, looking Scyther. <laughs> uh, got a Mareep Common from Dragon, or EX Dragon more specifically, I guess. Uh, Matang from Hidden Legends. And just to go back to the Dragon thing, it is so hard for me to try to find uh, stuff for this set because there's so many just like, there's Dragon type EXs now. Uh, there's Dragon Frontiers, which comes up more often than not when I'm searching for EX Dragon. Uh, and it's just a rare set anyway, so fun times me looking for a pack of that for my big giveaway. Or not my big giveaway, my big opening. Uh, we have a Metang, uh, which is another, oddly enough, rare from uh, Hidden Legends. We've got a Metacham. Doing some double team stuff there from the looks of the after image. I uh, got a Cyndaquil and a Fanpy. Nice little cute clay animation, or not animation, clay model from Deoxys. And this is one of the cards I was really happy to see that the, uh, the, the kid had. Uh, it was a Mary's Request. Uh, and like this is one of the two uncommon trainers I did not get for my 36 Unseen Forces packs. Uh, if you don't, if you haven't seen me open those, don't worry. I didn't open those on camera. That was before I started YouTube. Uh, but yeah, that was I was really happy to see that because I love the Unseen Forces set, and just great to get one of the uncommons I'm missing. Uh, but then we have a Shelgon from Delta Species, Kabuto from Legend Maker, Celio, Chimico from Hall and Phantoms, Zatu from Dragon Frontiers, Phoebus. Sharpedo from Power Keepers, Ponyta from Diamond and Pearl, a Reverse Sunflora, which is a rare reverse from Secret Wonders, Peachy Reverse, an uncommon from Stormfront, got a Beautifly from Platinum, and then a Reverse Cacturn, uh, uncommon, and a common reverse, Nose Pass, all from Platinum. Then we have a rare reverse Sableye from Supreme Victors, and I always love getting cards from sets I've done big openings for, uh, just because I did a big opening, and it's something I didn't pull from all those, so very happy to get that one. Then we got a Glalie from uh, Arceus. That's another, uh, yeah, that's another rare reverse. I uh, got a Crocorock reverse from Black and White. Swoobat from Emerging Powers. Sock. Altaria Hollow from Dragon is Exalted, and I am super happy with this card because this is the last Hollow I was missing for this set. So I've, I've never pulled this card. I now have it, and with that, all I need are Reverse Hollows and Ultra Rares, so that's super cool. Uh, but then the last two cards here are Pyroar Reverse from uh, Phantom Forces and Chandelure Reverse from Phantom Forces again, So, which is a little miscut, I'm noticing, but I don't really care about that. Uh, yeah, I don't care about miscut cards, so long as, like, the whole card's on the card, whatever. Uh, so, yeah, really, uh, thank you to the uh, two kids, actually, that I traded with to get all those. Uh, I hope they enjoy all the cards they got, because they were really excited to get those, and I'm really excited to get all that. Uh, but let's get into the packs, uh, especially since we're, like, nine minutes in. Uh, I'll start with the Flashfire pack, since it's the one I expect the least from. Although I grabbed this from a pretty full uh, booster box. So uh, hopefully we can get something cool. Uh, here's an online code card for you guys. This will get you a uh, flash fire booster pack on the online card game. Good luck whoever gets the code. Hope you got something cool. And so we have a Sentret. Phoebus. Bergmite. Roselia. Gumi. Protection Cube, Avalug, Fletchinder, the Reverse Hollow, 
is a Pokemon Center lady, which is an uncommon reverse hollow trainer. Uh, yeah, I have all the trainers in reverse already, so definitely a duplicate. Uh, the rare card is a Scrafty non hollow rare. So I also I opened uh, six other packs at the place uh, and then bought these three as I was heading out the door. Uh, from those packs, I only got one hollow which was kind of disappointing, uh, and nothing new for my sets. So, again, another disappointment, but hoping, re like, really m hard that we can get something cool here uh, to just make up for those earlier packs. Uh, we have a Yanma, Spiro, Helioptile, Murkrow, Venonat, Trickcoin, Zwilus, Lipard, Reverse Hollow, is a Purloin, which is a common reverse, uh, 56, got to pull up my checklist for my missing uncommons, or missing reverses here, uh, let's see, there we go, reverse checklist, and this is one I have already, so it is a duplicate reverse, that is okay though, uh, the rare card is a Pachirisu, non hollow rare, so I'm kind of hoping we have at least a hollow in this last pack, because uh, again, that would be one out of nine uh, packs from this place uh, if I didn't get at least a hollow here. But yeah, I don't know. I, I just hope we got something cool, or at, at least a hollow. Uh, we have a Murkrow, Zubat, Bunnelby, Fletchling. Carablast, Lampant, Furfro, Lissander's Trump Card, the Reverse Hollow is a Rog and Rolla, which is definitely a, a duplicate common reverse for me. Uh, a little disappointing to see another one of these. I don't know how many I've pulled. I'm going to say at least five at this point. Uh, but the final rare card, hopefully at least a Hollow, it is Haleavani non-hollow rare. So really disappointed with my pulls uh, today from this all this stuff. Uh, no hollow, not even a rare reverse. Uh, just pretty much bleh overall. I was hoping for something. I mean, like, I mean, I know it is just my bad luck with this place because I remember uh, when it was uh, Phantom F or no, Furious Fist was the last uh, release set. Before Phantom Forces was released, uh, I did pull a Lucario EX from a pack I got there. That was just off camera and while I was there at the league. Uh, but yeah, just disappointing to not get anything cool. And someone's home opening the garage door, so I guess that's a good point to end this on. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for more. Have a great day.